My name is Sergio Avila. I am a conservation research scientist at the Arizona Sonora Desert Museum. There are different types of impacts to the environment if we think about barriers. If we block the movements, the natural movements of wildlife populations in any direction, we might be blocking those populations from moving to places where they can withstand the changing of the climate. There is also the longer term effect of blocking populations of plants and animals that eventually become separated genetically. And though this is very long term, creating a separation there is like a barrier to their reproduction. The infrastructure that is proposed along the border is not only a wall, we're talking about roads, patrols along those roads, and helicopters, and high-powered lights. And all of these different uh, cases destroy the habitat. Other long-term effects could be the destruction of so much habitat that then we lose complete populations of, of wildlife. This is a unique place for, for diversity of life in the world. If you don't see political lines, nature has no borders. Ultimately, the impacts to the environment are, are the most serious consequence of this infrastructure.